Hey, how's everyone doing? This is the Minnesota Silver Roll Hunter here, and I'm going to be talking about the 1945D wheat scent. So hopefully everyone's holidays went well, and let's get down to it. The 1945D Lincoln wheat scent. It's a bronze comp composite penny. Mintage is 266,268,000. It was minted at Denver. The designer slash engraver was Victor D. Brenner. Metal composition was 95% copper, 5% zinc. The diameter of this Lincoln wheat scent is 19 millimeters. Mass and weight is 3.11 grams. <clears throat> so let's look at the obverse and on the front of the obverse of the wheat scent 1945D penny. We have in the center uh, Abraham Lincoln, and next to his chest on the right-hand side, we have the 1945 year, and the D underneath the 1945, which is the Denver Mint. And over to the left, on the side of the coin, you have Liberty next to his neck, and above on top, you have In God We Trust, and laid over the top of the coin. On the opposite side of the coin, we have the famous wheat scent pitcher, and uh, it's very beautiful. I love this type of coin, and I just like how it's made in general. And uh, The production of Lincoln wheat scent coins in 1945 yielded more than one million coins for commerce, meaning the pennies from that year are quite common even to this day in all circulation grades and in many of the uncirculated grades the 1945 Lincoln penny was minted at all three operating mints of a total of 1,040,515,000 that's the total between the Philadelphia, Denver and the San Francisco mint and you know at the Denver mint there's 181,770,000 uh... You'll find one in circulation for face value with enough searching. Look through rolls can help increase your odds. So if you're looking, you know, for your your collection, you know, do like what I do, coin roll hunt and look through coins and you can find find these, you know, mostly in your in the coin rolls and change. But however, if the thrill of the hunt ain't a motivation for searching po uh you know, basically you can search pocket change um, 1945 penny, you could buy, or you could buy a circulated penny for 5 to 10, 20 cents each from just about all, you know, coin dealers around your area. Um, if you include uncirculated specimens in your collection, instead you won't spend more than around like 5 bucks uh, for a decent mint state specimen. And a footnote here is 1945 pennies are not made with the usual 95% copper, 5% tin and zinc. Composition common for most years of Lincoln wheat penny coins. All Lincoln cents struck from 1944 through 1946 were made with metal from recycled shell casings deriving from the use during the World War II. So-called shell case scents. Of this area era are made with the composition of ninety five percent copper and five percent zinc, no tin. So that's a pretty interesting fact for these coins. You know, so you got the you know the war pennies. Um, you know, uh, most of them are all steel. You know, and then they have some that are copper, but they're you know pretty hard to find and you know worth some money. Okay, well, if you like my videos, please, please subscribe, please thumbs up, please comment, please share. And down in the description below, I have uh, links to uh, Amazon Prime uh, for things that you can buy for your coin collecting stuff like folders, even coins, microscopes, uh, you know, all kinds of stuff that I have linked down there. I'm uh, now an uh, Amazon Associate. So if you link through and buy anything, um, I get a percentage that would help my channel greatly. So 
please uh, have a very great day and happy hunting and good luck. Bye-bye.